What is going on YouTube? Yeah, I know I had to shave. This is probably, no, not probably, it is my last video on the channel, at least for a little bit, because I leave on Tuesday. Hey YouTube, this is Jay and T Customs. I'm Jay. I'm T. And how are you doing? <laughs> Veronica is on the ground. Something is touching me behind me. I don't like that. Spider webs. Um, not much is, is going on though. Um, because this is still empty. Um, however, it's on the ground. We, uh, Jay's over there in the corner drilling out holes in the motor mounts. Yeah, that'll be fine. Um, because we are putting on the original motor mounts he's working on this one right now from the 4.6 because they do line up they just need a little bit of adjustment um, but then they'll just should bolt right in with that being said we are going to drop the motor in the car today say hi Jay hi Jay okay uh, at least that's that's the plan uh, it might not be fully finished today but it should get in the car at least at some point today. And we buy So we gotta mark, mark off these. Can make new ones, right? Isn't that what we're doing? What's <laughs> up? Oh my goodness. Hi, Jay. It's gonna be like this all the way to the end. Oh man. Come on, I gotta make these last few videos exciting. Oh, they're exciting. Man. Oh yeah. That's not even on me. That's cool. Motor mounts are very expensive, so we are mocking up the old ones because we're not using them anymore. The motor mounts sit there and right there. Now, they are parallel to each other. Let's see if I can get that in camera. The problem with that is you have to get both motor mounts sitting in the same spot um, on both sides of the engine. Now, the problem with that is one motor mount is four bolts it's a square we are at this current moment uh mocking up the old ones just to put it in the car to then see where everything else is going to go um the uh the headers probably i mean i could buy headers but they're going to be like two thousand dollars and i really don't want to do that so we could custom make them i know a guy he knows that i know a guy so he's going to be excited about that um, no, he's not going to be excited about that. He's going to be miserable, but you know what? <laughs> Alright guys, we have... Did you tell me what it's set up? Oh, nothing. Yeah, thanks. Not sucking anything. Alright guys. Yep, we move Vern over, we move Veronica over, and we're going to put the engine in her. We took a bunch of stuff off so we can just get it down in there so we can mock up our motor mounts. Great. Alright YouTube, as you can see, scarily the 5.4 is in the air. We are test fitting and dropping it in the car um because okay the car's moving wait for i'm not ready i told you it gotta go up
YouTube after several hours of playing with it because that's just what you do we changed the motor mount to the front so now this motor mount is to the front and it's on its perch and this motor mount we had to take off because we have to make a new one now I wonder yeah, if Waste of footage so they can't see anything over here. This motor mount, if I get the same one, will it fit over there? No. T says no. Why do you say no, T? Because if they're size specific, when you put this one on that side, it's going to be upside down. Uh, T is absolutely right about that. It will be upside down. Well, Will it be? Because if I take that and turn it this way? Yes. I don't know. But anyways, there it is. So you can see how tight it is. Up against the firewall. It's tight back there. You can see how close the harmonic balancer sits. Yes, it's definitely the old one. So, there it sits now until we start mocking, <clears throat> mocking up motor mounts. So that's it for this one, YouTube. Alright, if you have any questions, comments, leave them, and we can try to help you out with measurements of your own. Or if you can give us suggestions, that would be great too. Like and subscribe. We'll see you soon.